Okay, got a field of uh, quite freshly grown grass. A load of uh, moles on it. The farmers asked me to come and try and sort them out if we can, so we're going to set a few mole traps. Okay, now work out which way it goes now, left and right. Yep. Yeah. And go now the other way. That's it. And then we've got the line, haven't we? Okay, quite deep that, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, I've marked a line where I need to dig. It's quite a deep, deep run this one. So the first thing I need to do is dig it out. Okay, it's a full depth of the trowel, this one. Getting all the loose soil out, clearing it out from the run itself, any soil that's fallen down the hole. And then I just need to fit it to size. Okay, the trap I'm using is a Telpax. Okay, so set the trap to size, then measure the hole. Okay, just need to cut some off that still. What you don't want to do is for the jaws to just catch as it's shutting. Okay, so that's nice and snug over the middle of the run. Just going to finally take out any soil out of the run. There's no need to tamp it down at all. But you want it nice and clear so it's not straight away thinking it's blocked. Okay, now I'm going to finally set the trap, set it as fine as I can, put it in the hole, and then with these towel packs, all I do then is I just trickle loose soil from another mould hill over the top of it. I'm not keeping it completely clear, as the mould with the towel packs and the trigger mechanism can push completely through. Um, without setting it off and it won't set it off until it actually gets in. Okay, just want to make sure it's nice and fine though. Okay, and you only need to cover it until you've blocked up the daylight. Okay, so there's no light getting into it. Okay, that's it. And then finally, last thing we need to do, mark it with a stick so that we know uh, exactly where to find it. Okay with this one I'm using a different type of mould trap, duffers mould trap, tunnel trap. Um, it, can, it can catch from both ways um, and we'll see how we get on. Quite a good little trap. These uh, at the moment, where I'm setting these, it's a field of um, freshly sown grass. Okay, and the farmer's uh, just asked us to come and try and catch a few of the moles as it's making a bit of a mess of the field. We've had three uh, yesterday, and hopefully we'll get a few more. This mole trap works, got two loops. That piece of wire holds it open. Set the other end. So it's a 
again nice and fine. Again what happens is the bolt comes through through this first loop, activates the trigger, which is that one, and that loop comes up and crushes this little body. Okay, into the hole that one goes. Nice and flush with the run, again making sure that the wire loops are flush with the run and that the actual loop is touching the bottom of the run. Okay, and then again, just backfill it as much as we need to. Okay, just taking care not to uh, block off the trigger mechanisms. Okay, we can put light soil on them, but not big rocks. Okay. And that's the uh, Duffer small trap set. Again, we'll mark it with a stick. Take care not to push it through the actual run itself. Okay. Okay, here's another one of the towel pack straps gone off. Again, I don't know whether there's anything in it. It looks like there is, but it could be blocked up. Okay, Jack, pull it out. Yeah, brilliant. Good. Good. Another good mole there. Uh -huh. Please with that, Jack? Yep. Okay, that's one of the duffer straps, the tunnel traps that's gone off. Uh, we'll have a look what's in it. Yeah, nice. Let's look at that. Let's look at that, Harry. Okay. Nice mole coat, that's one of the ones we've been after in this field. He's been a bit of trouble catching that one. Hold on buddy, I'll take it out for you. Okay, just pull it out Jack. That's right, get your good pull. Oh, another one. That's a lot. Yeah, good lad. Yes! Good. Hold it down a bit. Good. That's another one gone, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Right, let me take that one out. No. Go on, bud. Go on, bud. When? Okay, go on, chuck him. Chuck yeah, chuck yours at him as well. <laughs> What's it, bud? Who's it, bud? <laughs>